would you still use Reddit if it had the anonymity aspect taken away? Why or why not? I'd lurk and read, but I wouldn't post. Absolutely not. One time on Facebook I left a comment on some news article post the comment was something like I think I'm gonna get an induction cooktop next time because gas kinda freaks me out. Some lady got so mad that I said that. She replied to me and called me names and then searched for me via voter registration or something. And left another comment listing out my address phone number, and LinkedIn page. So no, I won't engage in social networks that aren't anonymous because people are out of their minds. Probably not. I would not dare to post anything or comment on anything. So it would take all the fun away. Uh, my former account was public. I had it for about five or six years. I got involved in a media scandal and had journalists and extremely right-wing people, politicians. Scrape it. Figure out my private Facebook. I think I, and a few others, would be more careful in what we say and which boards we take part in. Nope. Cancel culture. No, that's the one thing it has going for it. I might possibly still use it but I won't express myself honestly anymore. Anonymity is one of absolutely essential things to assure honest and open debate. When you can be hounded and publicly punished for having an opinion different than that of the majority, you cannot have free and fair debate. Absolutely not. That's just asking to get crucified in the court of public opinion because someone thinks you said something you didn't, or you try to offer a moderate, reasoned opinion in a rabid hate sub. It's a silly place and a fun place cause you can't see anyone's face. No. Reddit is therapeutic. In that I can discuss things I wouldn't generally speak about. With most people I know. Hell no, I'd immediately stop using nearly every website I frequent if the anonymity was gone. Not a chance. Same reason I don't discuss anything on Facebook anymore. People are too polarized and the public world isn't at all reasonable. I say something reasonable and piss off people on the far left and right. And that's with stuff that isn't controversial. I do have some controversial takes. And sometimes I just enjoy arguing as the devil's advocate to explore a situation. And that doesn't work in a world without nuance aka the internet. So that would be another thing I'd rather people not loathe me for. The biggest thing though is we are all one bad comment away from worldwide infamy. Like that woman who made a racist tweet getting on a plane and was fired and hated by the entire world by the time she landed from her plane ride and had literal press waiting for her. I enjoy all sorts of humor. Plenty of it not politically correct. And I'd rather not be vilified for that. Nope. I removed myself from every platform that had that because I was constantly comparing myself to other real people, wishing I had what they had. And it was not healthy for me. Here. I have no clue who any of you are. And it's been an incredibly healthy shift while still allowing some exposure to social media. Nope. This is one of the only places I can come without the fear that my ex will find and stalk me. Probably not. I don't want to broadcast my identity for security reasons. I think that is often forgotten about when people go rabid over online anonymity. If a criminal, hostile state actor can make connections of when, where, what you post. It opens up a lot of scary possibilities. No. Not because anonymity gives me the opportunity to be rude to people. I try to be as polite here as in real life. But because anonymity gives me the opportunity to talk about things freely that I wouldn't talk about if my actual name was attached to it.
I have no desire for family members or employers to search my name and stumble across me sharing an embarrassing story, or having a not-so-mainstream opinion, or fangirling over my favorite TV character or whatever other niche interests I might have. Not to mention the risk of being stalked by people you try to avoid. Nope. I use it a lot to vent about my personal life without fear of people I know reading it. Have you seen the sociopaths on R. Politics? No. Because that defeats the purpose of using Reddit for me. Sure. There's the obvious privacy concerns. But it would also completely change the culture of the site. Unlike other major media platforms. Reddit's discussions are usually, with some exceptions, centered around a subject rather than a person. New Reddit, profiles, etc. have taken away from this a bit. But it's still there. It's less, look what this celebrity has to say about coffee, and more, let's actively discuss coffee with strangers in this anonymous thread. Discussions are centralized around the topic instead of some random dude who has 500k followers.